uh, I'm fucking pregnant. I bet my lip. Yep. Balling on a budget. Oh, I look like that. <laughs> Who let me out the house like that? <laughs> you? You left yourself? <laughs> what are we doing? Oh, welcome back, guys. I'm in my natural habitat. So, sorry about that. Um, this is our third taco review. Back to taco talk. We're gonna be trying the tacos that are on. What shoe is this? Canoga. Canoga and. <laughs> Roscoe. Roscoe, next to the Chevron, like a few feet away. And let's <laughs> see how it goes. Shoeborn. Alright, guys, we just made it to the taco spot. It's the street name behind me. And, uh, Canoga. Miguel, how's the food smell from here? Delicious, but I already ate, so I'm only gonna eat like two tacos today. Dang. It smells oily. I ate two, but uh, I love me some tacos. Um, so two cabeza, one buche, one al pastor, two asada. So where else you going to? Yeah. All right. Uh, what size? Uh, what is it called? Tacos El Ranchero Chido. Yeah. Hey. I believe Lillian got a horchata. Hey, you know what? Let me tell you something. About me. This horchata tastes better than all than the last two places that we did reviews on. I enjoy it. I got two, ta two tacos de cabeza, one taco de buche, and one taco de al pastor. Two tacos de cabeza, one al pastor and one buche. And Miguel, of course, the usual, got the asada. And your review doesn't count. And on the bright side, they give you lemon. Oh, oh yeah, the lemon's already on the plate. Well, There's uh, radish. In this case, uh, limes. They're limes. Radish. I'm Mexican, they're lemon, okay? Look at the convenience. But there's this other thing, it's like curtido. You blocking the light, homie? Look at that goodness. Hey, you guys didn't ask me for nothing to drink. Oh my god, my mouth is watering. So I went to go get grilled onion and a chile serrano. Uh, We're just waiting on the sodas. Oh yeah, time to eat. Cheers, Miguel. What I mean, hold up. Right, I'm starting with cabeza. And I put some green sauce on mine. Me too. That first bite. It's really good. Fucking awesome. It's fresh, has great flavor. This taco look this side the fat's really well rendered. It's got the right amount of salt. It's mm, GAF. Good as yeah. The hot sauce the with the cilantro, the onion, the tortilla. Yeah, the green sauce, it's got good heat. It's not overwhelming like the last place where I couldn't even eat anymore. Overall amazing. It's great. What are you having next? Um, I recommend the salad. We didn't get it. We didn't get our salad this time, wow. so. Actually, let's do buche because if it gets cold, it's gonna get Oh yeah, you're right. All right, so I have no sauce on my buche. But uh, onion and cilantro. Alright, let me put some lemon on it now. Yeah. Mmm, it's definitely the lemon that makes it whole. A little bit of sauce. Though. Yeah. It made a huge difference. So the buche, you can tell it's fresh. It's not chewy, overcooked. It's got good flavor. Just put a little bit of lime in the green sauce. Flavor town. I like it. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. It's really tender. Okay. I like that it's not greasy. Mm -hmm. Definitely not greasy. Because a lot of places you get buche and it's just like. Ball of grease? Submerged in oil, fat, grease, whatever. Yes. And that's all you taste. This you can actually taste the buche. Mm -hmm. And it's good. Alright, are you starting on your next one? Apostle. 
Again, on mine, I have no sauce on mine, but onion and cilantro. That's how it tastes. Got my store smoke. It's definitely fresh. It has good flavor. And it dif differentiates from the last place we went to. It's not necessarily like. It's smaller pieces. Yeah, those like. Look the place he sliced it, which I thought was weird. I like it. As you guys can see, I finished the salad tacos. Delicious. 11 out of 10. Meat was warm, fresh. Um, the limes and the sauce was delicious. So after having these, what do you give the last place? Does the score of 10 out of 10 go down? Um, not to 9 out of 10, just because the other meat was grilled. Oh. It almost has a... Like a chorizo flavor. Yeah. But I mean, it's good. But yeah, it's good. <coughs> I feel like you can. It was marinated, huh? Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. You can tell when they took the love and put in the taco. Um, but the last taco we have here is um cabeza, cabeza again. And guys, one thing. Let me tell you, Lily doesn't like onion. Or cilantro on her tacos. I don't. And this is the first time she gets it and she loves it. No, you know what? I've been getting it in the past two reviews. Shh. I've been putting it on my tacos and, and, and I didn't realize what a difference it makes. <laughs> Alright guys, so this taco is so good that I just bit my lip. <laughs> I didn't get to try the salad tacos, but our friend here. 10 out of 10 says they're 10 out of 10. Believe me, Drake's voice. I, I don't know. Out of both reviews, I would say these tacos are the best so far. Yeah. Overall, what's your your score in, in, as in like customer service, uh, quality? Oh, the customer service was, was great. Had a nice attitude. Immediately was like, hi, how can I help you? Um, smiling? Yeah, smiling. We have some of their sauces outside as well as their uh, cortido. All right, so I like this spot. They have two tables. It is close to the street, so there's a little bit of uh, car traffic noise. But um, I like that they have hot sauce at the tables when you get your plate. It comes with uh, limes and rabanos. They also have this like little onion and habanero uh, like pickle slaw, if you would call it. Um, they have grilled onion? And they have grilled onion if you want some. Uh, she forgot my Coke at first, but she made up for it because she said, oh, you guys, your Cokes. But now overall this place, I would give it a solid you know, okay, let me tell you this. A 10 out of 10 for me would be handmade tortillas. You know, some extremely well tasting uh, meat and toppings like sour cream, real guacamole salsa. Uh, you know the works. That for me is a 10 out of 10. But for a taco spot out on the street, this place deserves a solid nine. Very solid nine. I would come here, I would come back tomorrow or even later tonight if I get hungry. Their food is really good, it's, it's well worth it. Tacos are about a dollar, actually, the tacos are a dollar 37 each, which is very reasonably priced. Uh, yeah, nine out of ten, definitely. Taco de cabeza, amazing. Taco al pastor, very good. Uh, even the buche taco was uh, my favorite out of any place I've been to around here. So, yeah. Regular. You see here? It's thick. It's got a good consistency. Since we've been here, they have plenty of customers. Yeah, so they have plenty of clientele. Uh, depending on what time you come or what day of the week, it gets pretty busy. Uh, but the food is fresh. They have great customer service. And as far as parking, 
You can park on the street or there's a parking lot right behind us with plenty of parking. How's that? I definitely recommend it. I think my chata was the best tasting on chata compared to the other two places. The chata tastes the best. It wasn't overly sweet. It wasn't watered down. It had a great taste. I feel like it's the closest I've had to like what would be a regular Mexican horchata. And I do give this place a 9 out of 10. What about you? I will come back. I'll be back here tomorrow, later today. Well, this In video will probably be posted later tonight and he'll probably be here again. Look, they gave us Probably plenty of limes that, plenty of limes that I even had left over. Hector's really hungry that he's gonna order more to go. <laughs> Wait, I wasn't recording the other day. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Huh? Fuck, I'm fucking pregnant. All right, guys. So we just left the taco spot. As you can see, I got food to go. That's how good the food is. Uh, I got mulitas. I wish we could have reviewed them, but um. I'll take you to the taco truck. Yeah, it's going to be on another episode. Stay tuned. All right, guys. If you're wondering why we walked today, it's because uh, Miguel didn't have any gas money. It was either gas or tacos. That's why he only bought two tacos today. Yep. Falling on a budget. <laughs>